everyone, my name is Jasmine and today we'll be making something different, delicious and yummy. Okay, so today we'll be making garlic fries, garlic french fries and this is actually at McDonald's. Since we don't have McDonald's in Botswana, I'm going to bring McDonald's home with one dish. So, the ingredients we'll be needing will be some french fries, parsley or parsley, parmesan cheese, some garlic, oil and salt. And the utensils we'll be needing will be a kind of scooping set to mix everything up and a teaspoon or just a normal spoon and a food processor. So let's get started. So first we're going to add in our garlic these are two garlic cloves and I've used the big ones if you guys have smaller ones then you can just add four ones four garlic cloves and this is um, a quarter cup of parsley and a quarter cup of parmesan cheese At first, we're gonna first add just a little bit of oil, and then if we need more, we're gonna add more. So now we're just gonna process everything up. And at this time, we're gonna add some salt, about a teaspoon of salt. Now these are not ordinary garlic fries, but these are cheesy garlic fries. And they're cheesy because of the Parmesan cheese. Okay guys, so now I've just got a spatula and the right consistency of a plate. So it's supposed to be like this. Kind of thick paste. So now we're just gonna add it on to our yummy french fries. Just add all of it. Now this is smelling delicious. I can smell the parmesan cheese, the garlic, the parsley. Now, if it's not seasoned for pasta in your country, you can go use some basil because basil also has a really good taste. Now, if you don't have Parmesan cheese or you don't want to add Parmesan cheese, then just add like a few tablespoons of oil because once I tried it with um, no Parmesan cheese and it is actually really liquid and it wasn't really good. So just add little oil when you make it without the parmesan cheese just toss everything up and then you're almost done now i want to make sure that every fry has a little bit of garlic paste because if you know some plain ones you want to get a tiny taste so just toss it up i like my french fries to be crispy not really soft otherwise you won't get really the crunch and the taste and they might get soggy a bit. So it's better you use the crispy ones and homemade. And these garlic fries, mm. french fries, I made them at home. And we're done. These are our delicious garlic fries. Mm, I'm gonna have a taste. Mm. Now I'll be calling my little brother Isra to taste. Okay guys, so now I have my little brother Isra here. Time to taste. You said that they don't look nice because they're green. That's not nice to say. But these are delicious. Mmm. These are delicious. He's been eating marshmallows the whole day. Mm. The most brilliant taste in here are the only two. The garlic and the parmesan. They bring up that delicious flavor. Mm. Guys, you have to use parmesan cheese. Just please try to use it because it gives that delicious flavor. Otherwise, you won't really get a flavor of the type of fry. But yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. And don't forget to try this recipe at home. Bye-bye. See you next time.